press. Uh, I'm sort of gutted to be honest. I think obviously had the worst possible start, probably going going a goal down so early. It's ended up being three 0 down. We fought back in the second half and we were so close to, to salvaging a point. Um, I'm shocked at what I've just witnessed. To be honest, uh, that's not how I set my teams up. It's not how I thought the lads would go about it. I thought for the first 60 minutes, it looked like we'd just met each other for the first time. We were so off the pace in every aspect of our game and what we've been good at um, over the last three months that we deserve to be, you know, a couple of goals down, to be honest, and it uh, could have been more. Uh, yeah, so I was, uh, yeah, extremely disappointed. Not frustrated. Um, difficult to get frustrated when players don't go about. Um, and we've just had a chat about it. You know, the simplicity of how we go about things and make it difficult for the opposition in and out possession was uh, was sadly lacking tonight. And uh, we deserved to lose. Um, could have been by bigger scoreline. Um, mistakes galore. Um, right through the team on many levels and uh, hence I, why we've conceded three goals. Could have conceded a couple more. Um, and then on the flip side of it, the changes had a real positive effect. We've had to score two absolute worldies to get ourselves back in the game from Alfie and uh, Harry. And. Uh, yeah, obviously everybody will talk about DJ's miss at the end. Um, you know, and I feel sorry for the young man. You know, and um, as long as he keeps getting in the same positions, things will drop for him. But would we have deserved it? Certainly not. Would I have took it? Of course I would. As, as poor as the performance and what, um, what I witnessed out there uh, tonight, I would have certainly took 3 3. But. You know, I'm sick of saying it to the lads with regarding the types of goals we're giving away. Um, when we're on it and we're defending well and we're stopping the opposition, creating opportunities, uh, everybody's got to be at full tilt. And uh, tonight we're way off it, to be honest. And uh, hence that's why we've conceded three goals. Obviously, on, on, on Saturday, I see we defend, defended really well. Um, and today, obviously, mistakes in sort of giving the ball away. What, what, what do you, what, what do you do? What, what can you do? Well, it's purely down to the individual's mindset, and then collectively, when the game kicks off, you know, um, we've got to be done demanding more from each other, regarding allowing things to just drift along and, and mistakes keep happening. You know, but um, similar to the Radcliffe one in the first half, far too many back passes to Greg when. You know, we can deal with the situation or certain situations um, themselves. And um, yeah, we encourage Radcliffe to get a couple by half time, and we've done the same again tonight with Matlock. But um, yeah, that's frustrating. And I said to him prior to kick off how well we defended second half against FC. But that's when we're at, we're at our best. Um, tonight, we didn't want to do that. And um, I felt they won far too much for the second ball um, for large periods. Um, their midfield looked livelier than ours. And um, their front line causes more problems than we cause ours. So, yeah. Um, pleased for Harry and obviously Alfie, you know, scoring. I thought Godwin was outstanding when he came on at half time. Really changed the game for us in midfield. He um, was an absolute nuisance with and without the ball. And that's what we were lacking in the midfield first half. I thought Daggers, uh, Tom, and Ethan were just nowhere near the level that's expected. And um, yeah, it showed. Can you obviously take, take some positive? I, I, know, I know it's a defeat, but from, from the fact that the players didn't give up. No, it? the only positive I can take out tonight is that we've uh, we scored a couple of goals, got it back, and we've only conceded one on the uh, goals against column. Um, 
because I was a little bit fearful at times with some of the decisions we were making and the opportunities they were getting. You know, I said to them at half time, if they don't buck up, it could be embarrassing. And uh, they did buck up to a certain degree, but that is the only positive I can take. And obviously, um, the two wonderful goals that we scored, uh, I suppose that's a positive. And uh, we did carve out a chance to, to equalise. Um, late on, so you know, it was f far too late for everything that we've done tonight, and uh, we deserve to get beat. How do how do the players pick themselves up ahead of obviously another game on Saturday? Yeah, we're gonna have to. We'll have a chat about it Thursday, and we'll see what their thoughts are. Uh, it'd be nice to get some feedback from them, you know. Um, but if we come on Saturday and uh, we play that way, then you know we'll continue another three. It's a simple one.